Welcome back to Out of the Blue. As you can see, we're busy preparing for the Chelsea's E Premier League Club playoff. More on that later on. How are you guys doing? Yeah. I'm doing well. Not too winter bad. break. How's your guys' winter break? I mean, break been? we've not had one, but the players have. Yeah, we, yeah. Well, they have actually. And let's have a look at what they've been getting up to. Mm. So we have Marcus Alonso and Kepa in Miami for the NBA. Okay. Not Choose bad. Reese James is in Dubai with a new friend. Oh, Taller God. than Tammy Abraham, it seems. Only just though. Then we've got Tammy Abraham in Dubai with Tamori. Oh. But here on the ground, we have Ruben Loftus Cheek working hard to get back to fitness. Exciting. Yeah, yeah. Man, fingers, yeah. Crossed. fingers crossed. Also, we're going to be chatting with him later. Oh, well, let's get it underway. Pedro into Loftus Cheek. Here's Hazard. And now Loftus Cheek to settle it. Oh, yes. That will do nicely. Ruben Loftus Cheek. Okay, so we're going to play a little game called Higher or Lower, and it's based on Instagram followers. Okay. How, how well do you know um, teams like the socials? I say I know a fair few of them, but not Enough. all of them. Yeah, and roughly as well. So let's see. Let's see. All right, you have 1.3 million followers. Does Hudson Odoi have higher or lower than you? Lower. I know this one. No, correct, yeah. So does Hudson Odoi have higher or lower followers than Marcus Alonso? Um, I'd say Callum has lower. Yes. Does Marcus Alonso have higher or lower followers than Pulisic? Ooh. I'd say Pulisic is higher. Correct. You're good at yes. this. You're good. Okay, so does Pulisic have higher or lower followers than Aspi Laqueta? Uh, Aspi higher. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> 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 it said lower and I was trying to work it out. I was like, wait. Okay, Aspi has 2.3 million. Okay. I would have thought that would be quite close. Does Aspi Laqueta have higher or lower followers than Rudiger? Um, higher. 1.1 million, so yes. Does Rudiger have higher or lower followers than Ross Barkley? Rudiger has higher. Yep. Yes. <laughs> yeah. 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 Yes. Why did you know all of that though? Did you just, uh, just Yeah, because we obviously we follow each other and stuff. So, so you just see. Yeah. Okay, that concludes the higher or lower game. Six okay. out of six. So here we are, we're inside Stamford Bridge. I'm joined by Dan, who's one of the 16 out of 3,000 people who attempted to try and represent Chelsea at the E Premier League later on this year. How are you feeling, mate? I'm feeling really excited like, to be here and to be part of this you know, E Premier League. It's second time, it's my second time here, and I'm looking forward to it. How often do you play FIFA, mate? Well, I play FIFA like weekly, it all Every day? Off. Yeah, it's literally every day. How many but, hours do you say you put in? Uh, I'd say about at least four hours so I get back after work and all that and then I'm straight back on there, you know. So if you are lucky enough to hopefully get through, exactly. you'll be representing Chelsea at the E Premier League. How does that feel for you? Well, even getting to this event, it feels absolutely amazing and I'm so happy to be here. Well, I actually think I'm a pretty good FIFA player myself. Now, I've done my warm-ups, I've stretched the fingers. <laughs> I want to take you on in a game and I reckon I could beat you. Well, we'll see, yeah? Well, let's give no, it a go, then. I don't think you could. No, no, I will. I will. <laughs> so why is it you support Chelsea? Is it from your dad? Oh, uh, no, it was, it was from my granddad. Like, he's been going since the, um, the running track was round. At oh, the Bridge. that's a long time. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, so he may be winning 1-0, and it may only be 10 minutes. Not part of the script, but uh, I will um, keep trying. You will keep trying, won't you? If, 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 I can keep a, if I can keep it to three goals minimum, I'll be happy. I thought you was about to say clean sheet up. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that, that's gone. <laughs> yeah. How do you rate me at the moment? I mean, yeah, against right. some of the other competitors. Uh, you're not on the kind of level as I was expecting, but... Oh, I'll take that compliment, <laughs> if anything. But you're decent, yeah. Oh, he says as he almost scores. Uh, no, no, as, <laughs> as he does score, as he does score. Um, at, at the current rate, it's a goal every 10 minutes. So yeah. <laughs> this could be a battering. 
So it's half time. I'm losing 2-0. You're still in it though, look. Uh, I have edge possession. So let's make that clear. I've edge possession, 54%. It's I'm at least of, winning at something. It's all about being clinical as well. That's like... He's had two shots, two goals. I've had <laughs> two shots, zero goals. So if maybe just the luck isn't going for me today. So you said earlier the average amount you play is about four hours a day. But sometimes is it, is it longer on the weekend? Uh, it's... Sometimes it is longer, but then sometimes I do like to have a little break because if you play a bit too much, then it's going to overdrive you kind of stuff. So yeah. you try and take your time with things. Oh my God. Good goal, on it? Um, <laughs> it may or may not be 3 0 from a wonder strike. And Kovacic has, he has scored this week, see. He yeah. has. I hate that celebration as well. Yeah, oh. But I've got to do it against you, you know what? Yeah, it's not, it's not going too well for um, the once mighty Zach Jalab. <laughs> so, I mean, he's already through. Kante v Kante. Well, that's a penalty. <laughs> um, oh, please don't send him off. Oh my god! Really He's penenkered me. If you don't know what a penenka is, it's where you chip the ball in a penalty and it's basically to embarrass <laughs> your opponent. 4 0. I have to do it. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> you actually didn't see it coming. Oh my god. Well, I'm you've never going to play. The thing is, you've still got a chance to get, you know. No, goal. no, I've got no chance you've to got get. A chance to get a goal. Here we go, the goal could be happening. No. Hey. Right. No, no. no. Not at all. Well, uh, uh, that's it. Much. I have been embarrassed <laughs> again on Out of the Blue. I've lost 4-0. I had to keep the streak up. Mate, all. thank you very thank much you for very the game. Much. I wish you good luck for the rest of the tournament. Yep. Over to you, Portia. Okay guys, so today we have a win or lose special. We've got Dan, obviously from Out of the Blue, and we've got Wolfie, Junior Blues presenter. And these guys are gonna be competing to see who is the ultimate Chelsea fan. So guys, how long have you supported Chelsea for? All my life. Yeah, since birth, obviously, yeah. yeah. From day one. No other way. Well, yeah. I think I'm the bigger Chelsea fan. Right, yeah. why? Uh, I would say, well, I know what he's gonna say, <laughs> and it's a bit of a, it's a bit of a, it's kind of better than mine. I've got but, a Chelsea toe on my chest. Yeah, I don't have that, but I do say I've got about probably 30 Chelsea shirts. I've watched pretty much every game, represent them whenever I can. Yeah, yeah. Listen, Chelsea control my entire mood, whatever True. happens in my week. <laughs> it's okay, Chelsea, okay. that's it, you know. Right, so this is how it's gonna happen. There's four questions, right? You guys are gonna write it down and then reveal it. Okay. And whoever wins is the ultimate Chelsea fan. Let's get into it. Are you guys ready? Good. Kind of pressured. A bit nervous, not gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> okay, first question. Can you name every Chelsea penalty taker who scored in the Champions League final in 2012 against Bayern Munich? Scored. Scored? Yes. Did we score four out of five? Ah, that's, I'm, that's cheating, man. I'm not telling you that. <laughs> okay, so you guys ready? Yep. I think so. Okay, who wants to go first? Wolfie does. Oh! Does it? Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, so it, does, it doesn't have to be in any order, right? No. I'm going with David Luiz, Ashley Cole, Frank Lampard, and Didier Drogba. Okay. He's right. He's who right. Have you got? And I've got three of those four. Go on. I've got Ashley Cole, Lampard, Drogba, and I couldn't remember for the life of me if Ivanovic got one. He didn't even take one. <laughs> Okay, so it's Drogba, Ashley Cole, Frank Lampard, and Louise. Louise is yes, in the roof for the net. David Louise absolutely rifled it. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. As you said, yeah, it, I, I saw the penalty. <laughs> okay, so 1 0 to Wolfie. Let's Are go. you ready for the second question? I'm ready. I'm ready. Right. Do an impression of Ida Good Johnson's famous celebration. Easy. So hang on, hang on. One of you go first, the other one has to turn the other way so you don't hint to anyone. So, oh, okay, you can go so first, Dan, you go first. first, you turn away. Can I stand and do it? Yes. Okay, Wolfie. Right, am I good? Yeah. Okay, so I'm just picturing he's just scored an overhead kick against Leeds. <laughs> okay. So I feel like that's a draw. Did we both get it? Yeah. I we think both we both got confident it. with that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, so 2 1 to Wolfie. Next one. Third question, guys. Who was Chelsea's first sign in following the Roman Abramovich takeover? Ooh. I think I've got it, you know. Oh, that's bringing it back. <laughs> it's getting tense, guys. It's getting tense. 
I know this is wrong, this is a guess, but I'm gonna go with Joe Cole. Okay. I'm yours. gonna go with Paolo Ferrero. Okay, you're both wrong. Ooh. It was Glenn Johnson. Glenn really? Johnson? What? <laughs> okay, so we've got one left. At okay. the minute, it's 2-1 to Wolfie. Who's going to be the ultimate fan? Who is it? So I just need to win this one. I need to get this correct. Oh, my God. OK, so fourth <sighs> question. How many goals did John Terry score for Chelsea in all competitions? The nearest to the number gets the point. It's a shot in the dark. Mine's, a, mine's an educated guess. Are you ready to reveal? Yeah. yeah. Are you okay. going first? I'll go first. Go on then, what's yours? I went with 52. Okay. What was yours? There's, there's quite a barrier here. <laughs> <laughs> I've gone with 37. Okay. So I can reveal that it was 67. Oh, yes. no. That's a draw. So it's a, it's draw. a draw. So you're clearly equal fans, but we have to have a winner today. So what we're going to do is we're going to settle it with a kick up competition. Oh, yeah. Result. All right, let's do it. So let's go outside. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, guys, so kick-up competition for the final winner. Wolfie, you're up first. Let's go. All right, let's do this. Ah! 15. All right, 15. Come on, Dan. <laughs> the Jordans, they don't help. <laughs> Control. Yeah, no need to panic. Oh. 21! Yeah. 21! Did it, finally. Fair play, fair play. 21 <laughs> 15 to Dan is the final winner. <laughs> Guys, you were so great. That was great. Did my groin there? So my hamstring's <laughs> gone. My hamstring's gone. Amazing. Thank you guys so much. Oh. Okay, guys, so that is it for today's show. But I have a surprise before we go. It's a moment of truth. Oh, no. Obviously, on the last episode, you guys commented saying who you would rather see in a onesie, oh. and the results are in. Are you ready? Yes. It is Zach. Of course it's Zach. Congratulations. Despite cheating. Cheating? Yeah. No, I, oh. I may have put a comment saying, oh, you, you, guys, you well. guys know what to do. It serves you well, right. Well, it didn't work, did it? We've got the onesie right here. Are you ready? <laughs> oh, come on. It's so cute. Right, you got to go put it on. Go See on. you in a sec. <laughs> oh, you look. <laughs> Sensating. Yes. Do I? Yeah, I 12, love it. 12, I love it. it. Pop the hip. <laughs> I'm not popping anything. <laughs> you might. Yeah. <laughs> Very true. It fits like a glove. I like it. Are you guys happy? Yeah. Because I'm certainly not. I am. That's the end of today's Out of the Blue. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, like the video. Just like it because of what you've done for me. Leave a comment for any other footballers you want to see in future episodes, and we'll see you in a fortnight. Bye.